there will a zombie in a zoo. That that corner and that corner up there, you can tell I'm streaming. Uh, so this is the first time I'm touching Fatal Bullet. Uh, I pre-ordered it. Uh, I put pre-ordered the limited edition, so I got the season pass and everything. Uh, so uh, I haven't seen anything on it. I've heard a little bit from my brother about how you can get four player groups, but each player can have AIs, and I've heard a little bit about it. I haven't seen any gameplay on it. I've been putting myself away from the game because I've been live streaming uh, Diablo season thirteen. Overwatch and uh, VR chat a whole bunch so I'm streaming this too uh, like I said this is my first time playing uh, they will be when I do videos later on for YouTube it will definitely be cut up and I don't know where the cuts are going to be so that it's not going to be an intro to every single video so I'm just giving you a heads up so if you jump into a random part but let's start this no data let's select this one <laughs> we do a male character because I don't like playing female characters in any game. There's only certain ones. We're making our guy tall because I'm tall. Oh, uh, arm length. I got long arms. Arm thickness. It's a little thick. I don't look like it from far away, but I am fat. Oh, uh, waist size a little. Oh, let's make that two. Leg length, legs are pretty long. Maybe that long. Leg thickness. My calves are big, but. Other than that, let's do three. Okay, face. Okay, so I have green. Uh, you probably can't tell. I actually. I don't have green eyes. I have. Um, I have. Uh, what is it called? Oh, hazel? Not hazel. I have the eyes where it goes from blue to green, like a, uh, I can't think of the color name, I can't think of it right now, but it changes from like a uh, bluish to a greenish, uh, but I wanted to gre have green, so I have green contacts in always, uh, but my next goal is yellow contacts, I love yellow contacts, would be my next thing I would like to go for. I eventually want to get off contacts entirely and go back to my natural color of eye like i want to get surgery eventually eye surgery and get uh so i don't have to worry about this ever but that's way long later down the road so we're probably gonna just go with green for right now uh i should just set color for both eyes i don't know why i didn't uh hair uh i have mine blonde right now and it's gonna be blonde for the most part but uh, I would love to get my hair if I can I might go with blonde just because I have it now I would like to get my hair down to white in the future every character I've ever made in any game always has white hair just because that's why I want to get my hair color down to it takes a lot of uh, bleaching and I don't have the type of money right now to spend on more hair product so I'll keep white for right now but if I can change that later on game I might change it back to blonde uh, I usually keep my eyebrows somewhere around the same tint just a little lighter we we'll go blonde because I don't want to do white eyebrows just because they don't stand out too much I'll do blonde but I won't do white eyebrows Like I said, I've been calling myself by my first name. Every character I do now. Other than Dark Souls. Dark Souls, I have a certain name that I name all my characters. Otherwise, I name every character by my first name. Not last name, though, because I don't really care about my last name. But I don't know how far we're going to get in this stream. Because I do eventually want to switch over to VR or Overwatch or something. So... We're going to play a bit of this, probably like two hours at least. We'll see where we, where we get from it. I look like a female character. I just realized my character looks very female-like, but I'm a male. Also, I'm, I'm going clean-shaven now. 
Uh, I have to shave again. I forgot to do it today. I'm going clean shaven, uh, because I want to do cosplay in the future, and most of the cosplay I want to play doesn't have any facial hair at all. So I need to go. I need to go uh, clean shaven. <laughs> イベント大会の参加登録が混んでて参っちゃった。ちゃんとログインできたみたいね。また。You managed to log in, okay, but been been waiting long. Who are you? あたしよ。あたし。わかるかな?Come my name is here. My name in here is, by the way. You're still the same old beacon. I knew it was you the moment I laid eyes on you. Cool. We have a childhood friend in this game. I will forget her name so quickly, but thank God they put her name in the text. Uh, how did it know it was you? Let's see. Oh, you had the unique or friendless and unsocial about yeah that kind of anyways me and I have a text text speed to one it's not even at two it's at one because I'm a slow reader uh, sorry for calling so I know this is your first VR MMO yes it is anyway I really appreciate it if I got VR gear in the future and I can play this game in VR, it'd be amazing. Uh, now let's get going. The tournament's about to start. Awesome tutorials. By the way, GGO is your first VR MMO, right? Don't worry, I'll show you the ropes. Thanks. So you know that completely immersive VR technology was made a a reality just a few years ago, right? It's still like 10 years from us where we can actually do this in our reality and that would be amazing. Uh, Young Jinja's name... Akio Kaiba. I can pronounce his last name but not the first name. Kaiba uh, invented a revolution piece of VR gear game head headwear called the Nerve Gear. And along with it, the virtual reality, massively, massively multiplayer online game, or VR MMO, known as Sora Online. Every gamer wanted to play SOA, S Sora Online. Well, almost every gamer. You never were interested in MMORPGs, were you? Turns out that was a good thing. The day it went live, Kaiba trapped roughly 10,000 players inside the game. If a player's health peak dropped all the way to zero, they died in real life. SOO had become a real death trap. It was Kaiba's trap card. <laughs> Yeah, I hope uh, one day VR gets so advanced games like this can be played. Yep. Yeah. Oh, well, me and my brother debate this every time, and we are fully up for it. If this game, like a game like S Sora Online ever came out, and it was the first of its kind, we would go full out, and we would be the first players for that, too. Because even if it would happen that it would be you die in real life, we would be full for it, too. We would be full in that game. Because as gamers, that would be freaking amazing. Because then you take the game very, very seriously. Like, I take some games very seriously, and Dark Souls is one of them. Uh, I have fun every so often, but I take it very seriously. So, seeing a game do that to me, it would take forever. The player had to work together to clear all 100 floors of Anacred. They did not clear all 100 floors, they cleared 75 floors actually. 75th floor, he killed the boss, which he figured out was the actual person who made the game. Uh, in return to reality, but I've heard that thousands of people still died. The impact of Sora Online is was huge, despite that VR games are as popular as ever now. 
That's all thanks to the Nervous Successor. The Emu, the Emu Spear. I'm gonna pronounce that wrong. I'm gonna pronounce it wrong every single time I see it until I hear the right translation for that. An updated version of that guarantees a hundred percent safety. There is Alfheim online or A L O, where players can fly through the skies as fairies. There is a new game based off Sora Online's original server called Sora um Sora Art Origin Origin. Or SAO. Then someone dis uh, distributed the VR MMOs to develop and package the seed for free. And using the program, tons of VR games were created. That would be Kirito or Kaz Kazuma? Kazuma. Uh. Oh, and. The bar. The Guy who owns the bar, I can't think of his name right now. Edgio? Display Gun Gale Online. More commonly known as GG. Oh, I'm just saying Gun Gale Online every time I see a apostrophe. Every time they shorten it, I'm going to say it fully out because that's the only way I'm going to get this through my mind. I'm not going to say it. Uh, to put it simply, it, it's a world of guns just overflowing. I'm getting a sword. I'm being rocking a sword. Super strong players. It has a game coin to reveal currency system, which means there are people making money here as professionals. So, it's one of the most difficult VR VR MMOs out there. It's best not to think too hard about it. Everyone's really excited right now because. There was a huge update in G uh, Gungale Online. And I wanted to bring you along for the special update tournament. I heard there's a super rare item hidden somewhere on the tournament battlefield. Exactly. I promise I'll make it up to you in a way that's completely priceless. You might be a beginner here, but I know you're a skilled gamer. Thank you, I am a skilled gamer. I trust your ga uh, game sense. I say that right now, but this would be the moment in YouTube where I put my first death like 10 minutes later right here and cut it in real quick because it'd probably be like five ten minutes and i'd jump off the edge or something stupid and die you can do it get your trick get that treasure for me i'm expecting a lot from you start quest G uh, gun gale online newbie because all of this is going to be uploaded to youtube just later on with edits and stuff uh jump cuts this beginning portion where I'm reading everything is probably not going to be cut. I'm very curious if I can start off the game and die in the first five minutes. I'm very curious now. It, I have implanted a seed into my mind to kill myself in the first five minutes of this game. Or the first five minutes they actually let me play. Whoa, it's Isuki. I wonder if he's... In the tournament too. Hey, what's with the puzzle look? He's that guy over there. He looks like a fashion model. Yeesh. So that's what you've got your eye on. Well, sure. I guess he is kind of cool, and he does have a lot of fans. That's Ishiki, one of uh, Gungo's online top players. He's the leader of Alfhard, Alf, Alf, Alf a squadron that renowned for its strength. Or stra squa squadrons? I said that wrong, but I don't care. Or kinds of like guilds. 
Uh, by the way. Okay. Yeah. Kimi tachi mo taikai ni sanka suru no? You enter in the tournament too? Yes. Kureha kun da yane. Uwasa wa kiite iru yo. Kiraha, right? I heard about you. Have you? You have? You always wandering between squadrons, right? You got quite the reputation. I hear you're reliable and have got good battle analysis skills. Thank you very much. Hey, hey, hey. Fella. Model person. I forgot your name already and it's been like five seconds. Go fuck yourself. I, I don't remember his name. They just told me his name like four times in those sentences. I don't know it. I just know he's a model. And that's it. He can go fuck himself. <laughs> I'm going to stream for a bit. I'll be popping back in later though. Okay. Well, see you then. And who's this? Looks like beginners. Newbie. Let me guess. You're a newbie, right? Oh, this. Yeah, go fuck yourself. This is my childhood friend and a real master when it comes to games. Although today is, today is Deacon's first time in GG01. That's like a challenge if you're entering a tournament on your first day. To be honest, I like that. Nice to meet you. It's e Isuki. Levels and skills aren't the only thing that makes you strong in a gun battle. I'm looking forward to an interesting fight. See you later. Model the... I'm, I'm gonna forget that name, Isuki, because I'm really bad with names. So I'm just gonna say the model. The model is amazing. But I'm almost good enough to make it into the top ranking. I won't lose that easily. You ready? Enter through their teleportation. Take you to the tournament dungeon. Can I want to run around first, or is you just gonna enter me in this teleport against my will? Can I say rape? Is that in the tech? Correct form. Rape! They're not letting me play this game. They're not letting me. Let, they're not letting me play this game like I want to. I didn't want to enter it. God damn it, you fucker! You put me in the teleporter. I know you did because this is not the tele. There's no teleporter here. I suppose we go over the fire, you'll be fine. I'm sure you'll get the hang of it in no time. Uh, to move around, to dash, A to jump, B to quick step. So it's just running, okay. そう、視線に違和感がないか、周囲を見渡してみて。もし違和感があったら、オプションで設定を変更ね。ここで待ってるから、ゆっくり調整してていいわよ。その調子よ。Equip your weapon, you can carry two weapons at any given time. Uh, tilt with our gun tilt to adjust your direction. Aim mode, okay. X to reload.
Bullet boxes are uh, okay. ジジオの特徴的なシステムの一つにバレットラインっていうものがあるんだけどこれは実際に見てもらった方がいいかもエネミーと戦って実際に体験してみていい感じねすごいすごいお疲れいいペースだ楽勝でしょ I'm, I'm curious. Give me one second. Let's see, he's gone. Let's see. What is this? Treasure chest, okay. I'm not even reading your text anymore. I gave up on that. Uh, okay, uh... Okay, can I die like this? I don't even know where my health bar is, to be specific. Dungeons have switches that opens the door. Looking for treasure. Give me the opportunity to look for treasure. I'm looking for treasure. What's happening? You understand the basics of GGO online. Gun get online battle system, right? You too. You can, as soon as you see an opportunity, run for it. That guy's with has gotta be pretty skilled too. Seriously outclass here. Hmm. Must I run and for it? Gotta admit, that's the right choice here, but you do realize we'll attack as soon as your bats backs are turned. Now if I run backwards. Fuck you. Fuck it. Every anything I look up, I'm not finding anything. I'll tell you right now, I'm not finding anything. But most things don't come up as left as the right path, so we're taking left.
Most of it, whenever I look up left or right, it always says in the search results, left never comes up as the right thing as in search results, so it's saying the right would be the right way. So I'm going left. Right is always right in my book, but I'm going left against my better judgment. さっきはなんとかうまくいってよかったわ。いつきさんは人気者だけど、やっぱりGGOのプレイヤーね。みんな戦闘となると容赦ないから気をつけないと。今回の目的は恋愛アイテム狙いなんだ。ほら、見て。Don't fall now. たいたいこういう装置を操作すると何かしら先に進めたりするのよ。こんな風に。おる。うう。落ち着いて。ワープゲートよ。すぐに追いかけるから動かないで。We're going to be moving. This and this is still tutorial, and we're gonna be fighting someone of stronger capacity. Come on, let me move. Well, they're both ways that lead the correct to the correct path then these live games make you choose a decision and it usually ends up in the same place <laughs> 